Good morning, Kurt here with Teach Mom How. Today I'm going to teach you how to create a new email account using Microsoft, okay? Microsoft Outlook. This is for admins, so this is for the Microsoft Business Account, Microsoft 365. You have to have that account and um, you're going to create a new user, a new company email essentially when you hire an employee, that's what this is for. So first off, you have to log in to Microsoft 365 online. Okay, once you're logged in, over here on the left, if you're an admin, you have to be an admin to create a new user. If you're an admin, you click admin. Okay, then you'll see your users. You can organize them into teams, but for right now, we're just gonna click add a new user and put the new user's information into here. I'm not gonna show this part on the video because it is uh, personal. Actually, I'll just do a fake one. Fake, fake, username is fake at homepros.solar. You can create the password you want, or you can choose my own password. We'll call the cat password fake, one, two, three, four, exclamation point. Oh, can't continue the username, okay. Test, one, two, three, four, exclamation point. Click next. You're going to tell it what products you want to license for our business. We want to give them the Microsoft 365 business basics. And I don't know what this is. We'll give it to them. Or you can create the user without product licenses. So if they don't need access to um, the business basics, they can just have an email address. Okay, but for right now, let's go ahead and give our, our employees access to that. They're just a user. They should, under roles, they should just be a user, not an admin. Click next and click finish adding. There you go. That is how you create a new email address, a new company email address for your employees using Microsoft 365.